it's been a pretty bad year for a lot of people uh, with the coronavirus. We haven't been affected too much in Queensland and I've managed to get a bit of cruising in, uh, got to the Whit Sundays and back. We're heading into summer now and it's, uh, it's time to head south. Uh, if you're going to do any travel down south, best time to do it is summer where it's a bit warmer and you get out of the storms and uh, the rain that we get up in Queensland. <laughs> Well, we don't wear skimpy bikinis. Hell, it frightens me when I take my shirt off. There's definitely no one pregnant here. This is motor sailing for old dudes. We do live on a boat, and we do cruise extensively along the Australian coast. Join us and visit some great destinations. Learn how to look after a boat and live off grid. It might even get you enthused to do the same thing. Hey, stay out there till you can't. I've been in the marina for a month, uh, doing an upgrade on the galley and having all my uh, saloon seats recovered. That's all done. So this morning I'll uh, go and hand my key in for the marina, get my deposit back, and uh, we'll head out onto the broad water. I'm probably only gonna go a little way. Uh, I've got a mate at Jacob as well, which is not far from here. Uh, a little bit of sewing to do on the sail, and he's got a machine to do that. So we'll get that done. Um, I'm going to put a few more supplies on, and then we'll head off. The plan is to head south. That's about as much of a plan as I can make, but it would be good to get down where my children and grandchildren are in Victoria uh, and see them for Christmas. But I'm not going to push it. Um, I'll just go with the weather and uh, you know, see where it takes us. You do tend to do the bigger miles when you're heading south because northerlies are hard to come by. The uh, trade wind here is southeast, so they're pretty easy winds to uh, pick up. But um, when you're heading south, you get a northerly and you usually do some long miles to uh, use the good weather. Anyway, we'll just play it by ear. We'll have a look at a few spots on the way down, but I think most of our exploring will be done when we're heading back north again. And hopefully, uh, at the end of that time, the borders will all be open and I'll be able to get back up into Queensland and um, do some more cruising uh, up north next year, maybe even go a bit further. But uh, yeah, hopefully the coronavirus thing is knocked on the head here and um, we're going to uh, have a better future. But it's one of these things you just never know. Anyway, if you like my videos, uh, keep following me. I'll keep traveling for as long as I can. And um, yeah, come and explore some of the places I'm going to see on the way down uh, the New South Wales coast and maybe even over to Tassie, who knows? Well, I was gonna leave today, but as you can see, uh, there's a few storms around, so um I've got another night in the marina, I'm going to use it up and uh, we'll go around to Jacob as well tomorrow. It's time to head south, I've finished all the jobs on the boat, but I think now there's a bit of green in that cloud over there, I think I'm going to try and move my car under cover so that uh, I don't cop any hail. Well, it's the time of the year we get storms uh, in Queensland, southeast Queensland, so I've just come up and uh, I've parked my car up under a veranda as far as I can go just to try and get out of what looks to be like hail coming. So uh, we'll just see how we go. I'm a little bit sheltered here, but um, if I'd left it out in the car park, I think I might've got a bit of uh, damage. There's definitely hail in it, uh, just don't know how big. Some pretty big lumps coming down now.
Well, we're out of the marina. We're not going far, just down to Jacob's Well. I'm gonna pull the headsail off, and uh, my mate uh, Bruce down there has got a good sewing machine. I've got a bit of a patch to shut sew on it. So that's the job for this morning, up nice and early before the wind gets up. Good to be getting going again, though. Let's head south. Yeehaw! Well, it's great to be out of the marina. Marinas are great spots. Um, I like them because I can leave the boat there and know that it's safe. A lot of people stay on their boats and live in marinas full time. It's not what I like to do. I figure if you've got a boat, it's designed to take you somewhere and that's what I want to do. The amount of money I spent on being in the marina for a month while I did those jobs would be enough to take me halfway down the New South Wales coast in fuel. That's the way I look at it. Great spots to leave your boat, as far as I'm concerned anyway, great spots to leave your boat, but uh, I'd rather be out here traveling. Our first destination will probably be uh, the Tweed River, and then we'll work our way down. We have to cross a lot of bars uh, going down the New South Wales coast, so we'll take you over all of them and uh, show you how to do it. A lot better the morning this morning, uh, after all the storms last night but it's really calm and I'm going to use this weather to get my sail down and uh, do some repairs on it.
she said stuff. <laughs> Like I bought one. It's good to be back cruising again and making a few videos. Thanks for watching and keep an eye out for the next one. We're having fun, hope you are.